Pylos, southwest Greece. High up on a hill with commanding views of the Mediterranean Sea, a team of archaeologists has spent 30 years excavating an ancient site surrounded by tombs. Dating back to the mysterious world of Greek mythology. The palace of the legendary Greek king Nestor has long been thought to hide ancient Greece's deepest secrets. Husband and wife archaeology team Sherry Stocker and Jack Davis have spent 30 years here unearthing evidence of the lives of ancient Greeks. In 2015, believing the site still held secrets, they cast their net beyond the palace walls. In an abandoned olive grove, they began to clear the undergrowth. We noticed that there were several stones on the surface of the earth, and immediately we started excavating. And as we went deeper, the four walls of a fairly small shaft began to emerge. 10 days into the excavation, the team hit something remarkable. We got a text from the woman who was supervising the trench, and she said, you better come quickly. They were about a meter deep in the shaft and had found next to nothing. And then suddenly there was a thick layer of bronze, and, and we knew we had something special at that point. The team had unearthed an incredible treasure trove so rare, nothing like it had been found on Greek soil for more than a century. Everything was made of something precious, precious stones, substantial amounts of gold and silver. There were beautifully crafted weapons, armor, stunning gold rings, exquisite jewelry with intricate carvings of heroic scenes. I still get very moved by this because it's, it was an amazing, an amazing discovery. And um, I don't think anybody ever imagines that, that in their career they'll find something like this. Then, finally, the reason for this incredible hoard of treasure the skeleton of a man. He was of moderate stature. He was between 30 and 35 years old. His leg bones and his arm bones are slightly bent, which suggests that he was very, very strong. Amongst the grave goods in the mystery man's tomb, Jack and Sherry found images of animals and mythical beasts echoing paintings on the nearby palace walls. Inspired by the eagle-headed lion of Greek legend, they named the skeleton the Griffin Warrior. 